children this video is about stereoscopic vision stereoscopic vision this is uh, the topic um, mostly important with respect to the definition and uh, this is um, falling in the chapter nervous system particularly the sense organs with respect to eye right it is also known as binocular vision right i mean this is the common name for stereoscopic vision binocular vision by means to ocular ocular word is used for eye ophthalmo and ocular these words are basically used for eye so binocular vision is the other name and this vision is basically the vision with two eyes two eyes two images falling on the visual cortex of brain and overlapping of two images will be there children all these words are important since we have the vision which is stereoscopic because we have two eyes so two images are formed separately on the yellow spots and we know that we have optic nerve which takes this impulse to brain which area of brain the visual cortex visual cortex right this is the area of brain where both the uh, optic nerves basically take the impulse right and when the impulse is sent to brain in the visual cortex the overlapping of both the images is uh, done and due to this overlapping what are the facilities that we get we actually get a kind of 3d vision 3D vision means the exact idea of distance, depth, and height. Here, 3D doesn't mean that uh, I'm going to elaborate D for the third time. 3D means three-dimensional vision, right? So you can do this experiment with yourself. You just close one of your eye and start watching any object which is kept at a distance. You won't be able to mark the exact size of the object, exact distance or exact depth when the coin is fallen on the floor or some kite is in the sky or any bird is flying in the sky. You won't be able to mark the exact height if both the eyes are not open. Right. So this the exact idea of distance, depth and height. Remember this exact idea of distance, depth and uh, height. This is basically given by the binocular vision, right? Uh, understand uh, all these words are important children. So understand this. Uh, whenever you are writing the definition, how your definition will be there, you need not to mention the two images overlapping this, that. You just mentioned that stereoscopic vision, also known as binocular vision, is the vision with two eyes leading to the overlapping of images in brain and uh, giving the exact 3D vision, right? And giving the exact idea of three dimensions, only this much is to be mentioned. So, just take care of that. I have added one picture here so that you get the idea that uh, usually these are your two eyes, right? And this is the visual cortex of brain. So, uh, sorry, uh, just hold on. No, these are the two eyes. These are the two eyes, right? So, suppose uh, in one eye, the, this image is formed. In the other eye, this image is formed slightly tilted and then uh, optic nerve these dots are optic nerves which are actually taking this to the brain and there both the images will overlap to form a refined image which is giving you an exact idea how the things are looking like right this is stereoscopic vision and to conclude this video just understand that sometimes it is asked that what is the nature of the image which is formed on yellow spot it is always real and inverted so that means the image which is formed on your yellow spot is inverted but when the impulses are taken to brain your brain basically makes you see the things straight not inverted so it's the miracle of brain that you are seeing the things straight uh, not inverted 
okay otherwise the image which is formed at the level of i on the yellow spot is always real and invert i conclude the video here thank you if you have any queries please feel free to ask